Hello and good day. Andy here with Pop Yachts. We're checking out a really cool fishing and cruising ready. Grady White 230 Gulf Stream. The hull itself is a 1993 model in beautiful condition inside and out. This is the second owner that purchased it in 1994. It's been repowered with 2013 Mercury twin 150 horsepower four stroke outboards. Just over the 100 hour mark on them. Lots of deck space, a really good balance to the cabin interior room. Really nice hard top that provides excellent shade. And then you've got your wraparound enclosure with nice clear and soft Isinglass. Combing pads along both sides with under gunnel rod storage. The walkthrough transom boards have been replaced with starboard. Looks really nice. Sea Star hydraulic steering. Motors are in great shape. Storage boxes along the top side. Beautiful fit and finish on stainless steel cleats and flush mounted rod holders. There's a total of three batteries on board. On breaker switches. Nice clean build. Easy access. Third batteries, house battery. There's our other starting one. And the other rear storage box. All the upholstery is in really nice shape. Grab handles right where you need them. Got your live well over to port. All the lighting has been replaced with LEDs. Spreader lights at the rear. And then a fish box over on this side. Double S storage at the moment. The walk around design provides easy access to the bow area. You can hang out up here, fish, sit and relax, get up right front with easy access to tend to the anchor. Nice bow pulpit as well. Anchor hides away in its own locker. Really nice stainless steel bow rail. Gel coat's in great shape overall, as are the windows and hatches. So you've got two rod holders on each gunnel, and then another five up top on the hard top. This holds 147 gallons of fuel. The most efficient cruise is right at 25 knots. You got your Mercury Smartcraft gauges, digital and analog mixture, an extra 12 volt plug that's converted to two USB, nice for charging a phone or MP3 player, tilt helm, smooth steering, power trim and tilt, it'll link up to the throttle handle, and all your accessory switches right where you need them with the Ritchie compass pointing you in the right direction. North Stars 951X GPS and chart plotter. And then a Ferrono bottom sounder. Transducer's been replaced for it. Vent windows open up, let in some nice breeze. Power switch for the spreaders. And a night light there. Really spacious cabin design. Sleeps too comfortably with the bunks along the starboard side. 
backrest lifts up. You've got an onboard head with holding tank. Fresh water sink as well. Good amount of headroom in here too. Storage under the step. A little more space in the rear space. Insulated cooler. A couple of beverage holders. Some more storage underneath the sink area. Plenty of room to stow away gear. The bottom of the anchor locker. All the upholstery is nice and clean. I don't smell any funny smells or see mold or mildew anywhere, which is really nice. You got safety straps that then lift that up. And I'm 6'3", and I still have plenty of room, so someone even taller could sleep on the bottom bunk. Please take this opportunity to check out all the high resolution photos we have posted on popyachts.com. And you can give me a call today. My name's Andy. I'm happy to answer any specific questions you have about this really cool and versatile 1993 repowered with 2013 Mercury 154 stroke Grady White Gulfstream 230. Nice walk around. Let's get you out on the water and having fun. Talk to you soon.